Today I'm going to be showing you how to grab JPEGs from Google and easily convert them into vectors without any effort whatsoever. It's very simple. Um, it works best with silhouettes like these, just images you can clearly see, but however they're still JPEGs, so you need to convert them into a vector. What you do is you click them, trace bitmap, quick trace. Give it a second and boom, it converts the JPEG into a vector. Um, this vector was sitting right on top of the JPEG, but um, as you can see, there's a background still there. There's a white background um, right there. So if I just ungroup it, I can delete these backgrounds. And then I have the bunny. Same thing with the butterfly, quick uh, trace bitmap, quick trace. And it loads for a second. And then I ungroup and delete the background all right and see that antenna is not attached so i can weld that to the butterfly and i have a vectored butterfly very simple very easy to do for little designs like that uh, more elaborate designs like these uh, sometimes quick trace work works great sometimes it doesn't um, if i click this snake trace bitmap quick trace boom it worked great um, there's not a whole lot of detail missing at all. Now for the bird, let's try it. Trace bitmap, quick trace. As you see, it took out some detail. Um, so I'm gonna show you how to get that detail back. So you see the wings right there, it's missing over here. Same thing with the claws. If we zoom in over here, you're missing a claw. Um, so we can just delete that quick trace. What you can do, click it, trace bitmap, outline trace and let's go to a high quality image and it will load and that looks pretty good and we just press ok we can move it over and you see like for text it doesn't work very well <laughs> see it's not it's not a perfect text you could totally tell that's quick trace but for the image um, it can save you a lot of time depending on what you're working on it's not perfect at all but if you have deadlines to meet you can quickly meet those by doing a quick trace like this then we can ungroup it we can delete this bottom delete any backgrounds that may still be there and then um, if you wanted to change the color to blue or whatever you can easily do that just like that for images that have a watermark over it like this one um, you can quick trace it and sometimes the watermark will go away. That does not always happen. So I'm going to show you a uh, high quality image quick trace. So the watermark will still be there. Let's press OK. So you have the watermark. All you do is you ungroup it and you go in and you delete the watermark just like that. Um, now some of the black like this right here. Uh, it's grayed out or sometimes the watermark will be morphed into the black uh, kind of like this um, all you do is you delete the parts you don't need and then you weld all the parts you do need together so like this if we weld it we weld it we weld all these parts together boom now it's all a part of the pig and that's how to easily vector jpegs in corel